Hello and welcome to another episode of Laptop Retrospective. And today I have an envelope from Yubico. And it's always a good day when I get uh, one of these because I know that there is gonna be something really neat inside. I will say right up front that whatever is in this envelope, I did not pay for, it was sent to me by Yubico. But that being said, you know that I'll give it a fair shake one way or the other. I have thoroughly enjoyed Yubico's offering, especially in their YubiKey 5 NFC USB. It's pretty much on my permanent keychain for work in terms of accessing my account on a variety of different workstations. The one challenge, of course, is that with USB 3.0, even though it is very, very common, if you have devices that use USB Type-C, such as the bottom of most modern phones these days, you really can't stuff this in there. And if your phone doesn't have NFC, and a lot of them are surprisingly coming without them these days, uh, that means that you're limited to like an adapter like this that you have to like fumble with and stuff on the end of your key, uh, shove into your phone, and then you can finally verify the account so long as the phone understands that that's what's happening to it. Thankfully, a lot of phones do, but the problem still remains. And I suspect what is inside this envelope is going to address this specific problem. So without further ado, let's go ahead and break the seal and see what we have inside. And I am not disappointed. So what we've got here is what they're calling their 5NFC Experience Pack, which is introducing their brand new YubiKey 5C NFC, which is pretty much this, but with USB Type-C on the end, which I think will be an excellent uh, opportunity to future-proof. So inside here, they have provided the USB Type-C key, and it looks like it's got the same build quality that we can expect from the regular USB key. And there's this beautiful picture here of the different iterations of the key, so much so I'm Pretty sure that's gonna end up being the thumbnail for this video. Let's see if they've included any other goodies because I think I see stickers. And I do, yes. Other than being pretty, there's actually a legitimate reason to use stickers like this because if you have several security keys on your key ring, which I do, being able to color code them this way is just a helpful little indicator to you which key is which. And generally speaking, if you're using one key, you're using two, and you might be using them from different accounts. So other than being stylish and providing a basic level of protection, there's also a logistical reason for doing this. So with that being said, I am going to stop gushing about stickers, and we are going to take a look at what this awesome piece of kit is going to offer us. So we're just gonna detach it here. As always, there is a guide on the back if you have never used one of these security keys, but since we are no stranger to these on the channel, I'm just gonna go ahead and open up the packaging here. And already I can tell you by holding this in my hands that this is easily the best built security key that I have ever felt. I'm gonna reach back over here for my 5 NFC, and the 5 NFC is incredibly well built, but I can, I can tell that probably due to this, they had to make it even more robust because that connector is sticking out. So because of that, it has to be a lot more durable to withstand uh, any kind of exposure or damage that this, might, this connector might undergo. So let's go ahead and set it up and see how it works. All right, so I've got the Surface Book 2 here. Still, oddly enough, the only laptop that I have with a USB Type-C connection. I suppose I just have to get with the times. And I've got a Google account here that I am going to set up on this YubiKey here. And I'm gonna choose a security key as an option. And of course, I already have it at the ready. So I'm gonna register the security key by oh, sticking it in there. That is a snug fit. And once again, super fast, as I would expect to see from that sort of connection. And the key has been successfully set up. Now, the nice thing about this key being set up is then I can now transition over to my phone. And for this experiment, I will go ahead and open up an incognito tab so there is no uh, history of me logging in. 
And as you can see, it is prompting me. So I have two options, of course. I could either tap this key on the back. As you can see, it gives me the option to use security key with NFC. And we're gonna use the security key with USB. Stuff it into the bottom. It says it's going to, or it's gonna ask permission for us to access the key. Hit OK. And then of course, all we have to do is tap the key and we are now back in. So if you don't have a device that has, uh, if you don't have a device that has NFC, then this, off, um, this becomes your next best option. So ladies and gentlemen, I think it's pretty clear to see that YubiCo has another winner with this style of YubiKey with that USB Type-C. If you are mobile or if you're using modern hardware, this to me is a no-brainer. This thing is incredibly durable. NFC plus USB Type-C means that you're practically future-proof on most devices, whether they be Windows or Mac, considering that Mac has an awful love for having these ports and practically nothing else on their computers these days. Uh, this to me is uh, a fantastic little piece of kit. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. And if you are looking to purchase one of these for yourself, I'll leave a few links in the description of a few different places that you can pick up such a key. As always, I'll encourage you to do the big four as with every video. So please like the video, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. So the next time I get the opportunity to feature a security product like this one on the channel, you'll be the first to know about it. Thank you so much, and I will see you next time.